this will give you some good clues on a potential problem with your liver. The first thing we're going to talk about is the little red and brown dots. They can be uh, larger and smaller, and you can also have like a little shininess to them. They're usually on the lower leg. That is poor circulation, and that is usually a liver problem. It could also be diabetes, and then something called spider veins, which usually see this in cirrhosis. Um, and what's happening to the liver is you're building up a lot of estrogen. Then we have cracked heels. This is usually a vitamin B3 deficiency or an omega-3 fatty acid deficiency. Itching of the foot, usually in the bottom of the foot, that is a backup um, of fluids into the liver. It's co a congested liver. It could be bile backing up and you're getting a buildup of histamines, a congested liver, so you can have itching in the foot. You can have pain or inflammation in the bottom of the foot. A lot of times people associate that with something called plantar fasciitis, when it's really not plantar fasciitis, it's just a liver problem. Bad odor, so you have smelly feet. Why? Because the liver is not able to detoxify correctly and it's backing up through the skin. Hitting edema, that's where you press your finger into the lower leg and it leaves a dent and it just stays there. Uh, that's fluid backup. That's a common liver symptom. Fungus, toenail fungus. They usually have an imbalance in the micro uh, flora in the gut and um, that is going to relate to an overgrowth of fungus and yeast on the outside of the body. The nail bed, the nail bed is going to be white because of the poor circulation that's occurring on that nail bed. 